What's up my friends? Welcome to the video. So we are down here in Fort Lauderdale. Last cheat day we were in Vegas. The cheat day before that was Sarasota. The next one's gonna be in Massachusetts. So we're just bouncing all over the place. But today we do have a very special guest. Ooh, ninjas! <laughs> My bro, Mr. Nathan Figueroa. How What's you feeling? What's up? I'm good, man. I'm hungry. Yeah, you ready man, to that, eat? Co that coffee got me going, too. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. All right, we are going to a place called Kiki's. I've never been here. Nate has been here before. It's fire. It looks amazing. Yeah. Let's go. have our breakfast in front of us and I am super super hungry it's been it's it's 10 25 a.m. right oh, now yeah we're starting late so it's a little bit of a late start to the day but I did go with the banana turtle stuffed French toast so we do have bananas pecans uh, cream cheese filling and yeah it just looks super amazing and I also did get some whipped cream on the side whipped creams the go and then also Nate and I both did go with a barbecue chicken omelet. Omelet, yeah. yeah. I, was gonna, I was gonna say barbecue fajita. I don't know why I wanted to say fajita. Could you copy me? Yeah, yeah, right, bro. I, I saw it first. Copy me. All right, so yeah, barbecue chicken omelet with home fries, white toast, and yeah, I am uh, ready for you. Good. Um, yeah, hell yeah, I'm ready, dude. Look at this. This is this is this is a masterpiece. Yeah, it looks amazing, bro. Hell yeah, dude. Yeah. Good. You ready? Yeah. What are you going first with? I don't want to go for the omelet. Yeah, you copied me again. <laughs> you read my mind. All right. Ooh, the barbecue. Oh, I love barbecue sauce so much. Too, bro. Ooh. Damn, this smells amazing. Low. Is it magnificent? Is it delectable? That straight up tastes like incredible. I just took like a bite of like a barbecue wing. Oh yeah, like right. A, like a drumstick. Uh huh. With like the best barbecue sauce. Lava juice. Dude, that is fantastic. <laughs> right. Damn, bro. That's crazy. It is so easy to eat. Mm -hmm. You can just like you don't even have to chew. You can just. Oh. I'm gonna make a barbecue chicken sandwich. Barbecue chicken egg sandwich. Well, I'm not gonna do that with please. cinnamon raisins. Yeah, yeah that's why I didn't weird. get it. I was like, I didn't sounds even... good. You want two of those pieces? You want two of these? Let's do it, bro. All right, dude. Here you go. Thank you. Appreciate yeah. it. Now I can experience Look what you're experiencing. Yeah, I know. I didn't even think of that. You know, I wish I had the barbecue sauce for the home fries. I'm a huge fan of these. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those are really good. They're not like super fried. Mm -hmm. They cook like perfectly. Dude, this breakfast is real deal. And we haven't even got to the French toast yet. Mm -hmm. Wow. Two at a time. Oh yeah. Right. Last bite of the omelet. <clears throat> ten out of ten, bro. Ten out of ten? Yeah. I can't say that no more. People got mad at me because really? I said ten out of ten too much. Yeah. Dude, that was really amazing. All right, now moving on to the French toast. It just went by too quick, huh? That meal, yeah, yeah, went by way too fast. So again, I do have the banana turtle, French stuffed French toast, bananas, pecans, cream cheese inside, caramel drizzle, powdered sugar, whipped cream on the side. What do you get? 
It's like the same thing, but uh, no banana, chocolate. I, I, I don't know. I think it's just turtle. I think that's what it's called, turtle. Yeah. I think turtle's like pecan and chocolate. Is it? Okay, yeah, this pecan, this pecan in here. To be honest, it's like a, this is a work of art. Yeah. This should, this should be like hung up in a museum. <laughs> yeah, this should not be eaten. No. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna... Oh, you're gonna hand it? Yeah. Oh. We should swap one. I'm done. Mine's probably better though. I just really love fruit. So desserts. I. You know? I love bananas. Mm -hmm. Dude, you have to try the banana cream cheesecake from Cheesecake Factory. Have you tried that one? I don't think I have. Dude, unbelievable. 10 out of 10. Not for real though. It was wild. Seriously, my favorite cheesecake from the Cheesecake Factory. Can I try one? Absolutely. No. Okay, so. I think they're fantastic. I think chocolate's. There's not much chocolate on it, but I taste a lot of chocolate. Yeah. Yes, sir. Let's grab this one. Alright, so I'm gonna try out the turtle French toast. So it's kind of the same thing as mine but no caramel, no bananas, and there's added chocolate. And probably not as good. Yeah. It's good, don't get me wrong, but this is probably gonna be better. Yeah. Which it is. I put the little bite. Mm. This is good though. This is good. But I do like mine better. I do too. I almost forgot about my whipped cream. Can I get some whipped cream? Mm -hmm. Michelle, that's too much whipped cream for you anyway. It'll help mellow out the chocolate. Oh. But no, you're, um, I love this one. Yeah, it's really good. The banana just adds like a, a really unique sweetness to it. Yeah, this meal went by too fast. <laughs> The last and final piece. Ready? Dude, this meal is perfect. Ooh. Damn, that was lovely. All right, so super fantastic meal here at Kiki's, again, thanks Nate for choosing this place. Oh, yeah, dude. The omelet was amazing. The barbecue chicken combination was just phenomenal along with like the white American cheese. But yeah, it was top notch. And then stuffed French toast, mine was definitely better than Nate's. Yes, it I think, was. Yes, it was. I think it was because Way it had better. bananas and the caramel sauce. Yes. You know, I'm not too big a fan of chocolate. Neither chocolate is good, but um, his was good, mine was better. But uh, yeah, solid first meal. Solid meal one of the day. Hell yeah. And uh, yeah, so. All right. I stop 50, 50K. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I will uh, check back with you guys very shortly. Peace. You got your mama's personality, same eyes as I got. <laughs> I'm, just <laughs> I'm just kidding. Go ahead. <laughs> so we just left Jupiter Donuts, and y'all thought we weren't gonna have donuts today because we didn't start with them. And again, sorry, some people don't like when I start with donuts all the time, but I have to at least have some donuts during the cheat day because. I really do enjoy them. How about you? Yeah, I do. I love donuts. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we did leave Jupiter Donuts and we got a total of six donuts. We're basically going to have three each, but we're going to split a apple fritter and a cronut. But I'm going to start with this blueberry frosted. That's and uh, which one are you going to start with? I'm going to start with the opposite of what Nick is going to start with. A lemon frosted sprinkles. Damn, that smell good. Let's do this one. Cheers. Boom, okay, there you go. Oh, that's super lemony. Mm. It's very blueberry. Mm-hmm. Blueberry. I've never had mm. a lemon, or I've never had this donut before. 
Mm. And Jupiter is good. Mm -hmm. I like Jupiter. It's been quite some time since I had it. The blueberry sweetness is real. Dang, you finished that already? <laughs> Holy cow. I'm like only, I'm like only halfway in. And this coffee was from this morning. I ended up getting one before I went to uh, Kiki's. Do you love me? <laughs> I was just thinking it in my head. <laughs> <laughs> okay, big bike crew. My next one, I'm going to go with this chocolate toasted coconut. Look at that. It is a cake donut. Again, oh, you want a cake donut too? Yeah. There's, oh, sure. Is there, there's cake too? Mm -hmm. Oh, no way. I didn't know you wanted cake. I thought that was uh, yeasted. Mm -mm. That, cake. Looks, that looks good. We were just talking crap about cake donuts this morning, <laughs> and we both got cake donuts and didn't yeah. even realize it. Yeah. So here I have a, it's like a cinnamon, it's like a, no, it's a French toast cake donut. And the lady said it was one of her favorites, so I was like, okay, since it's one of her favorites, um, I'm gonna go ahead and throw that one in. And yeah, love me some French toast, so. Yeah. Chocolate yes. coconut? Yeah, yeah. I, I always used to get this when I was young, like at uh, Dunkin' Donuts. Mm -hmm. It would always be like the, um, uh, yeah, it was like a chocolate, but it was like fully, Covered in okay. coconut, so bon appetit. Bring it back to the childhood memories. Yeah, bon appetit. Oh, that top. Oh, it's it's blueberry on the inside. Mm. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. It has a French toast cream layer on top with that cream in the middle. Oh yeah, that one's the blueberry French toast. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, crazy. Yeah, this one's good. So it does have like a chocolate layer under the coconut. It's pretty chocolatey, but not like extremely chocolatey, like. Nutella, where it'll kind of shut me down. Mmm, <laughs> mm. that's nice. Yeah, this is good. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and big bite this last piece. Mmm, <laughs> little bite. Donuts. Oh yeah. All right, two donuts left. Which one do you want to go for first? Um, we'll save the front up for last, I guess. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this front is heavy, bro. Oh whoa! <laughs> Look how massive that thing yeah, is. Yeah, this thing is crazy big. Yeah, we're actually splitting this. Um, we're actually splitting this. Break this baby in half. Mm. Oh, is that tough? Oh yes. <laughs> yeah, like, oh yes. Thank you. Yes, sir. It's been a minute since I've had an apple fritter. Look at that. Ooh. There you go. Cheers, mate. Boom. And the apple fritter. We actually have another donut after this. Yeah. Yeah, that we're going to split as well. Mm. Ooh. Okay. It's like candy coated. Right? Damn, it's a good apple fritter. Oh, I do remember the last apple fritter I had. It was in Germany at Royal Donuts. They were experimenting on how to make apple fritters. It was really good too. I feel like the European countries are so behind on like donuts. Or they just don't have many of them. They don't have many of them. You know, because I get many subscribers that are like, we don't have those donuts over here. Mm -hmm. You know, they have like a, a Dunkin' Donuts, but they're all kind of very like standard, plain donuts, you know? Mm -hmm. So I'm sorry for you guys. I wish you guys could taste these. What? Who's done? I don't know what the guy said. I think you might have to back up. Oh. Over here. All right. I don't, honestly, I don't know. I think I have to move. He's driving into me, bro. <laughs> okay. I just got punked out of my parking spot. He didn't say. He just kind of like rolled past us. He thing. walked by, drove by, look. Like, Is that what you wanted? I guess so. All right. All right, so we are driving. <laughs> we are driving. Until we find some more shade. Well, we a little bit of shade right there. Yeah, okay. Might as yeah, well just go there for now. Yeah. We don't have much food, love. Yeah. 
You, you seriously got punk, man. I know. Go and fight that guy. I like this spot better anyway. Mm. You gotta go and fight that guy now. <laughs> Your subscribers are gonna make fun of you. Damn, you ate that already? Yeah, man. Sorry, I, I eat fast sometimes. Now he's gonna punk us out of the spot. <laughs> All right. The last and final donut. Well, the cronuts. I'll show you guys what it looks like before I rip it in half. Kind of a baby one. Definitely not as big as the fritter. Mm. This is it? <laughs> yeah. That cronut disappeared into nothing. <laughs> it's one bite. There's less than one bite. Yeah. So, Cheers. let's finish it off. Oh, that's cinnamon. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna try it. <laughs> That has a nice cinnamon pop. It's very cinnamon. Just like um, pink box donuts that I just had last weekend in uh, Las Vegas. Well, all right, the donut fix is complete. I'm pretty satiated, pretty satisfied, and uh, feeling pretty good. How about you? I'm good, yeah. Good? Uh-huh. Yeah, all right. Yeah, I think uh, we're just gonna kick it for a couple hours, go visit Reese's, see how right. the puppy's doing. Yeah. And uh, yeah, we will be back soon. Or like in a second. Yeah. Like actually right after this clip. We'll be back in a flash. We'll be back right after this clip. <laughs> Come on, Mr. The Figueroa's. <laughs> my friends so we are here at Tucker Dukes again I've never been here very excited the food looks absolutely amazing I went with the burger and uh, Nate and I are gonna share some wings which are looking super tasty yeah hope you guys can see them we've been sitting here for a minute as we set up then we're gonna share some Cajun fries which I already tried a couple I couldn't help myself oops we lost a couple and then uh, what kind of burger did you get? Oh, should I explain mine first? Yeah, yeah. All right. So my burger, I did go with the, uh, what was it called? Was it the Sunny? Mondragon. Or Mondragon. Mondragon. So yeah. this thing has, oh, it's crazy. It's a pretty good size burger. Yeah, so there's four slices of bacon, four slices of cheese, a uh, big old beef patty. We do have some lettuce and egg, and it smells amazing. Uh, what'd yeah. you get, Nate? Um, I don't, I forgot what this was called. Uh, it was Loco something? Yeah, it was like called like Loco something, but it's supposed to be one of like their best burgers. I've been here on like a few other occasions and I've never had this one, so um, the lady said it was her favorite and uh, hopefully it turns out pretty good. Oh, yeah. Good? Cool, man. Yeah. All right, let's eat. Cool. Okay. Let's start with the burger? Yeah, I'm gonna start with the burger. Okay. Are you gonna start the burger or what do you want to do? I was gonna go for the wing. For the oh, go, go ahead and get the wings. Alright, I'm gonna go for a wing first. You go for the wings and I'm gonna um, go ahead and cut right. my burger open. These wings are really good. Are they? They're nice and crispy on the outside. Yeah. Okay. Very flavorful. Right. And here's, the, here's the insides of it. Burger is cooked medium just the way I like it. And uh, let's go ahead and dig into this. It's a little spicy. I kind of like it. I've only taken one bite, and I can taste a little spice. All right, I guess I'll go for my burger too. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna attempt to try to bite this thing. I don't know how well it's gonna go. Oh wow! That's like super big bite. Yeah. Uh, kind of intimidated, but. Can you do it? I'm gonna give it a go. All right, I, that counts. Kind of got it. Yeah. The flavors of this is, it's, it's, it's pretty good, it's excellent. Mm. Wow. It has the little chips in it. They're almost like little fries. Crunchy, perfect, thank you. So this thing is very bacony. Extremely bacony. Nice and salty.
So we just got done with half the burger. And I would, I would give it a strong, because I gotta be critical, because some of you guys say, I say 10 out of 10 yeah. too much. I'll give it a, I'll give it an eight out of 10. But I do want to give it a 10 out of 10. But it's gonna give it, it's gonna have an eight out of 10. Okay, I'm just gonna crush this before I move on to the fries and Feels, the wings. yeah, yeah, same here. It, it's kind of messy, so I kind of want to just Get out of the way. Get it out of the way, exactly. Alright, last bite of the burger. Oh, wait. <laughs> last bites of the burger. Last bites of the burger. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, amazing burger. I'm gonna go ahead and try out some of these fries. So they are the Cajun fries. Move the bump. Alright, I haven't tried the Wings yet? They're good, man. Nick claims that they're good. Oh, yeah, these are super Cajun. Mm -hmm. I, I love Cajun flavor. Yeah, it has a crazy season to it. I'll have to agree with Nick. Wow, man. Right? These wings are good. Mm -hmm. They have a really nice, like, crispy crunch on the outside, and then, like, soft white meat on the inside. I ate all the fries. <laughs> My bad. No, you know what? <laughs> My appetite isn't there, man. All right, chicken wings, fantastic. Now, um, I haven't had any of the fries. Nick's pretty much demolished them, but that's okay. Um, that's okay. They're really good. They're really, they are really good. They have like the same kind of spice that yeah. was on the chicken wings. The same um, Asian mm -hmm. uh, seasoning. All right, guys, so that was Tucker Dukes. I was really impressed by the food. The burger was massive. The wings were super tasty. They had the nice yeah. little crunch on them. The Cajun spice as well, as well as the fries. What do you think? The fries were awesome. I think everything was good. Like, I've been to Tucker Dukes a few times, and I've never had anything that wasn't tasty. So, yeah, yeah. you can't go wrong. Yeah, good call. That was a solid meal. Yeah, glad you liked it, man. All right guys, so we are here at Cream Nation and Nick got like a crazy ice cream taco and then he got like Fruity Pebbles on it so I had to at least get some Fruity Pebbles on mine. So I did go with two scoops of vanilla on top and then a mint chocolate chip scoop in the middle so that way when I eat the cone, it'll be like mint chocolate chip with the cone. So it's strategy. Bon appetit to the last meal. Mm. And it's melting everywhere. Yeah, the strawberry ice cream is amazing. I think it's called uh, ah. very, very strawberry. This is getting messy. Yeah. Honestly, I wish I would have got what you did. The taco seemed like a good idea. I figured this would be easy to eat. Uh huh. But you have, have to eat it right away. Yeah. I've literally been holding this for like a good five minutes, ten eight, minutes, eight minutes, ten minutes, yeah. eight, nine minutes. How did Reese's get out of their bag? Top's open. Oh, oh, oh my god. For the ice cream, I had vanilla, and then I had um, blueberry cheesecake, which I had last time. Mm. And blueberry cheesecake is good. Again, they had like 
a pretty big variety of toppings to put on it, but I guess I'm kind of pretty basic. You just got to the mint chocolate chip, and it's super minty. Mm. <clears throat> mm. You know, Cream Nation actually has a challenge here. It's like a challenge. I said it in the last video that I wanted to do it like in a cheat day. It's supposed to be like some big like monster ice cream like this big. And eventually I'll do it. Just obviously not today. But man, the ice cream just went by so fast. I'm done. I have no more. I'm almost there. You're almost there? I'm just leaking everywhere. Yeah. You just gotta you just got a big bite that team big bites. There you go. Add a boy. That's the way to do it, bro. Yeah. Ice cream's not supposed to be neat. Ugh. So kind of be messy. Ugh. All right, that, uh, that pretty much wraps it up for the food for the day. Yeah, it does. Well, all right, my friends, another cheat day in the books. So it was a super fun day. Again, I just came off from being sick for like three days. So my stomach capacity wasn't super massive or large, you know, to where like I could consume tons of food, but I definitely enjoyed myself. That's what's most important. And it was a super fun time hanging out with Nate. And Reese's. <laughs> and Reese's. Yee. Good times, bro. Good times. Thanks for uh, coming out, by the way. Hell yeah, man. Thanks for having me. Appreciate it, man. Yeah. And so again, be sure to subscribe to Nate's channel. It will be in the description box down below. Just do it. <laughs> and a big thank you to all of you guys for all the love and the support. Much appreciated. And I'll see y'all in the next video.